Hi, hey. I'm David Siegel, and today we're doing a fun experiment with magnets that you can do at home. You're going to need some alcohol, a good tight clear bottle, wax paper a bit, and a toner cartridge and a good magnet. This is a 150 pound magnet, but if you have a strong neodymium magnet like this, that's fine. And if you have two, that's even better, okay? All right, so you're gonna need some toner and there's no reason to trash a toner cartridge. This is actually the big trick here because other videos don't show you this. So the first thing to do is find out where the toner lives in your cartridge. In this one, this is down, and this is the reservoir down at the bottom. But it's easy to get toner out of a cartridge, okay? You just drill a hole. And so, I, I won't show drilling, but I've got about a 3 8 inch hole here that I drilled straight through with a drill, took out the pieces of plastic, and it's not hard to get the toner out. And we don't need a lot in this case because we got quite a bit yesterday to start, but we're gonna add some more and I wanna show you how this works. And you can see I'm getting to the end of this toner cartridge, which is fine. I have another one, but. I assume you wanna keep this cartridge and put it back to use, and then you're just gonna use a piece of tape. Uh, duct tape is great, or electrical tape. And honestly, you do that, you kind of redistribute it back, and you're back in business. You just put this back in your printer and it works great. That's not a problem. So now, we've got a bottle of pills, and this is the perfect bottle, and I'll just put this here for another day. This is the bottle you want. Okay, so we'll, uh, you can start with the powder or the Alcohol either way. I'm just gonna put this all in here. I know what I'll do. And then this we just tap in. Got a little piece of paper here. Just tap that in. And this is how you're gonna do it, just like this. So that will that will go in easily. Any paper will do really. make sure you want a reasonable amount of toner it's uh you'll see you'll see how much toner you can always put more too right it's not a, there's no chemical reaction here it's just toner suspended in alcohol that's all 70 percent rubbing alcohol the normal alcohol you get at the store Ooh. and it's just suspended so you can always add more That's risky. Yeah, I don't need that all over my tabletop. Let's hope this is watertight. Right. Now I do have a little bit of glue here. See that? And I'm gonna try, have a little bit of glue goo gone here. So I'll try this on the seam. And also I think just light oil does a pretty good job on gluey, sticky stuff. You just don't want to use acetone or alcohol for that. There we go. Okay, that's it. Now you've made it. Now we're gonna switch and I'll be the cameraman and Shy will show you what you can do with this bottle of solution, of toner alcohol solution. Here it comes, here it comes. Here comes the magic. Now, the stronger your magnet, the faster this happens. And now you've got all the toner. Show us where the toner went. In the bottom. Take away the magnet. And there's the toner.
thanks for watching. Hope you will enjoy making your own. Toner suspended in alcohol fluid dynamics with magnet. Now let's try this. Hmm. Hmm. Magic. Further research is required. GoPro, stop recording.